Hello my dear students, welcome to Baiju's exam prep. Hope you guys are fine. So guys, in today's session, I'll be telling you what are the topics which you cannot dare to miss if you're preparing for GATE 2024. Guys, you already know that hardly you can say that we have approximately four months left, that is 120 days. So there are certain topics, even uh, if you are just selecting some topics and starting and leaving some topics, then also some topics are there which you cannot dare to miss. Okay, what are those topics? Let's talk it about. Okay, let's be quick. First of all, before going through this, let me tell you that these topics are based on the past few years from which maximum questions are being asked from this topic. Generally, they have not been missed. Consequently, the topics are being asked from this particular subjects. Okay, so let's talk a bit about, if I talk about SOM, in SOM we have uh, basically stress and strain, bending stresses, transformation of stresses, and slope and deflection are the topics which kindly study and go. Okay, so if right now you are like, you are almost at 10 or 20% of your preparation, and you are like kuch chhod rahe ho kuch pad rahe ho to in topics ko to pad ke hi jana isse mat chhodiyega don't leave this topic and go okay now talking about <coughs> agar <coughs> excuse me if you are referring to the books like uh, generally i say that right now there is not a time that you can read the entire books puri books padhne ka time nahi hai but uh, for a particular topic for a particular concept if you want you can refer the book gere and timo shanko for conceptual purpose and for numericals you can go to bc panam okay next topic uh, next topic talking further about the topics is structural analysis here indeterminacy static indeterminacy kinematic indeterminacy study that topics ild influence line diagram kindly study that topic and trust this topic okay so don't miss this topic study that talking about if you are a book person and you're like no ma'am i have to refer to the books without that i don't get the feel and all those things so you can refer the book uh, for conceptual you can refer rc hibbler and for numerical practice you can refer ramamurthy okay Next topic further for RCC, obviously now RCC again comes for 6 marks. So if you are talking about the important things, so kindly don't leave pre-stress concrete for sure. Similarly, shear reinforcement and being designed by LSM. Okay, don't leave this topic. Talking about books here, one book is there which I refer and I like this book because it covers each and everything. Basically, concepts also and practice that is Pille and Menon. Okay, Menon and Pillay, you can refer to this book. It's a very good book. If you want to, otherwise notes and PYQs right now is sufficient for you. Okay, because reading the entire book and covering that, it's not possible. Okay, talking next is steel structure. In steel structure, if I talk about plastic analysis and connections portion. This year also, they have asked questions from plastic analysis, riveting, bolting, welding. Generally, questions are asked from this topic. Plate, girder and all, they are not very much common, but plastic analysis and connections are something which don't leave it. Of course, I know that uh, steel doesn't come for 5 marks or 10 marks, okay? But still, if 2 marks and 3 marks it is giving you just by starting plastic analysis and connections, then if you have covered the major high weightage subjects, then you can go for starting plastic analysis and connections. Talking about the book, you can refer to the book by S.K. Duggal for steel structure. Okay, this is a very good book. I personally like this book. Okay, now coming to the next subject that is fluid mechanics. Fluid mechanics forces on plane and curved surfaces, venturi meter concept, laminar flow, a velocity profile, pipe flow, Reynolds number. These are important and Proust's number. Uh, here model, prototype, that portion, dimensional analysis also becomes important. Okay, so don't leave these topics and go. Uh, I won't say that FM do it at the very first uh, because I told you this year paper was something like in the very first uh, full moon session there was hardly questions from fluid mechanics. Okay, so uh, basically if right now you don't have much time then study open channel flow. Okay, uh, if you have covered 50-60% of the syllabus currently, then you can fluid mechanics. Padu. You can start with fluid mechanics. But right now, if you are at 10-20% of the syllabus, the 20% syllabus he who are, then I'll advise you that abhi fluid mechanics don't study right now, just study open channel flow. Because open channel flow, generally that questions are there, you'll be able you'll be able to solve it. As a rocket science or out of the box question never comes. Okay, so right now, if you are at 10 to 20% of the syllabus completion bus who are, or 70%, 80%, 90% is remaining, then right now study only open channel flow. 
Okay, talking about the books, so Modi and Sade Bansal, your book is also there, but I prefer Modi and Sade. Okay, now talking about soil mechanics again, fourteen to sixteen marks it comes. So yeah, a great weightage. Talking here, phase diagram, consolidation, seepage, and effective stresses, shear strength, and Terzaghi theory for bearing capacity. Don't leave these topics and go. Do study these topics and go. Okay, talking about the book, you can refer to Gopal Ranjan and Rao. B. C. Punamey is also a good book. You can refer to that also. Okay, so see, I know that it has a very big part to cover. That's why I have told you the selected topics which you have to study. Okay. Now talking about highway engineering here, side distance, super elevation, that Webster method, that is a patent question asked many a times. Capacity of highway. So study these topics and go. See right now, of course, I want that you should study the entire syllabus. But right now, actually, maximum students were asking, ma'am, could could you tell us the important topics? Okay, because we have to first figure it out. What are the topics we have to study? The moment we have completed that topics, of course, we will study the entire syllabus. But a confidence आ जाता है ना कि यार इसमें जो ये questions हैं, जिन-जिन topics से पूछे जाते हैं, वो topics मैंने com complete कर लिए. भले उसके बाद मेरे पास अगर time बच रहा है, तो मैं बाकी का pending syllabus या पेंडिंग टॉपिक्स जो मैंने छोड़े वो मैं कंप्लीट कर लूं ओके सो आई विल कंप्लीट द पेंडिंग टॉपिक्स पेंडिंग चैप्टर्स व्हिच आई हैव लेफ्ट इट बट एक बार कॉन्फिडेंस आ जाता है कि मैक्सिमम क्वेश्चंस जो रिपीटेड टॉपिक्स से पूछे गए वो मैंने कंप्लीट कर लिए सो दैट्स व्हाई आई एम टेलिंग यू दीस टॉपिक्स ऑब्वियसली पढ़ना तो पूरा ही चाहिए बट राइट नाउ इफ एज आई टोल्ड यू 10 टू 20% या जीरो लेवल पर हो तो ये टॉपिक्स तो पढ़ना ही पड़ता है ओके नाउ टॉकिंग फर्दर अबाउट द बुक जस्ट टू एंड खाना दिस इज अ गुड बुक यू कैन रेफर टू दैट Okay, talking about surveying, surveying me compass surveying, traversing and leveling. These are the topics which you have to study before uh, going. Because surveying पे भी अच्छे काशे questions पूछ ही लेते हैं. Uh, questions are very simple, हाँ. Uh, sometimes like uh, in the afternoon session <coughs> they have asked questions from pixels and all. So that was some question this year afternoon session out of the box questions पूछ लिया था. Otherwise generally questions are something which you can do it. So Uh, out of the box, बहुत uh, chances are very less. Generally, एक आध question once in blue moon पूछ लेता. Otherwise, uh, the questions are जितना पढ़ोगे उसमें से आता बन जाते हैं सारे. Okay, talking about the books for surveying, you can refer to book by B. C. Panamya. Okay, talking for engineering hydrology. इंजीनियरिंग हाइड्रोलॉजी में फाइव इंडेक्स एंड डब्ल्यू इंडेक्स पढ़ना ही पढ़ना यू हैव टू स्टडी इट दिस ईयर फोर नून सेशन क्वेश्चन आज बीन आस्ट हाइड्रोग्राफ यू हैव टू स्टडी दिस ईयर फोर नून सेशन यू नो फाइव मार्क्स हाइड्रोलॉजी वॉज आस्ट इन द फोर नून सेशन हाइड्रोग्राफ क्वेश्चन इज आस्ट रिस्क एंड रिलायबिलिटी यू हैव टू स्टडी दिस ईयर आउट ऑफ द बुक्स मीन्स टिल नाउ फाइव ईयर्स पास्ट कभी नहीं पूछा नेवर आस्ट बट दिस ईयर दे हैव आस्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम एरिया वेलॉसिटी दैट इज फ्रॉम स्ट्रीम फ्लो मेजरमेंट दे हैव आस्ट ओके सो काइंडली स्टडीज में दो तीन मेथड्स ही हैं दैट इज डाइल्यूशन मेथड अल्ट्रासोनिक मेथड एरिया वेलोसिटी एंड स्लोप एरिया सो काइंडली स्टडी दिस एंड वन टॉपिक ऑफ करंट मीटर सो इन स्ट्रीम फ्लो मेजरमेंट इफ यू टॉक इट इट इज वेरी वास्ट सो इन दिस आल्सो यू हैव फ्यू टॉपिक्स लाइक डाइल्यूशन मेथड वन इक्वेशन इज देयर जस्ट रिमेंबर दैट ओके देयर एरिया वेलोसिटी मेथड स्लोप एरिया मेथड एंड देन यू हैव दिस अल्ट्रासोनिक मेथड एंड करंट मीटर these five topics are there stream flow measurement ke andar that only you have to study that is more than sufficient okay now talking about next uh, uh, if uh, talking about the books there are many books but uh, engineering hydrology by subramaniam that book is a very good book you guys can refer to that talking about irrigation engineering irrigation engineering water requirement of crops duty delta when you talk it about and in water requirements permanent wilting point field capacity that is a patent question maximum times questions from that is asked study that and gravity dams no sliding no overturning that criteria you have to study even this year they have asked question like in afternoon session gate 2023 they have asked question from cross drainage work Okay, so kindly, that's very simple. It means if you will give time in half an hour, you will complete that. It is so simple. Okay, so CD works, you can complete it in half an hour. It doesn't require more than that. Max to max one hour. It is that simple topic. Okay, now uh, talking about the books, you can refer to the irrigation engineering by S K Garg sir book. You can refer to that. Okay, now environmental engineering again twelve marks. So yeah. Here you have to study quality parameters of water. Uh, typically, study chemical and biological parameters of water. They are very very important. Then uh, raw water treatment, sedimentation, filtration, coagulation, disinfection. So these topics becomes very very important. 
then in sewer systems uh, just uh, self cleansing velocity formula and uh, flow when it is flowing partially or flow and full flow those things you should know solid waste management and air pollution generally study that because nowadays if you see the past 5 years uh, pattern every year they are asking questions from air pollution and solid waste management ha i agree that some questions are out of the box kabhi nahi pucha gaya kuch alag hi mixing height pooch liya kuch aisa pooch liya definitely i agree but har bar aisa nahi hota definitely there are some questions which are uh, past repeated questions ki tarah hi hota with uh, one or two more concepts so solid waste management and air pollution to pad ke jana और जो रॉ वाटर और वेस्ट वाटर वाला पार्ट है वो पढ़ के जाना एंड मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंटली डोंट लीव एक्टिवेटेड स्लैश प्रोसेस आई डोंट नो बट देर इज लाइक अ स्पेशल लव फॉर दिस टॉपिक एवरी ईयर चाहे वो वन मार्क्स में ही क्यों ना पूछा जाए बट दे आस्क क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम एक्टिवेटेड स्लैश प्रोसेस एवरी ईयर कभी दो मार्क्स में पूछ लेगा कभी वन मार्क्स में बट दे आस्क क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम एक्टिवेटेड स्लैश प्रोसेस ओके नाउ टॉकिंग अबाउट द बुक सो लाइक इफ यू आर अ हिंदी मीडियम स्टूडेंट या बेसिक इंग्लिश आपको पसंद है यू कैन गो फॉर एस के घर very simple english very smooth part 1 part 2 hai. one is for water supply engineering next part is sewage disposal and air pollution engineering if you want to go certain higher you can refer to the book by p v andro baki uh, itna vast hai ki uh, if you want to refer to book refer for a particular topic because abhi time nahi hai that you can read the entire book okay so that's all for today guys i have told you all the subjects all the important topic ha rahi baat open channel flow ki गाइज uh, अगर आप दो से तीन दिन देते हो सिर्फ ओपन चैनल फ्लो के लिए यू विल कवर इट सो टू टू थ्री डेज इफ यू गिव होल हार्टेडली फॉर ओपन चैनल फ्लो पी वाई क्यूज कंसेप्ट सब लगा लोगे तो उसमें रैपिडली वेरिड फ्लो ग्रेजुअली वेरिड फ्लो एनर्जी डेप रिलेशनशिप यूनिफॉर्म फ्लो फोर टॉपिक्स आर देम ओके आई राइट इट ऑल्सो इफ यू वॉन्ट सो जस्ट मिनट इफ यू टॉक इट अबाउट ओपन चैनल फ्लो यूनिफॉर्म फ्लो एनर्जी डेप्थ रिलेशनशिप ग्रेजुअली वेरिड फ्लो एंड रैपिडली वेरिड फ्लो ओके दीज आर दोर टॉपिक्स विच यू कैन स्टडी एंड मैक्सिमम टू मैक्सिमम पी वाई क्यूज लगाने पूरे कंसेप्ट यू हैव टू स्टडी टू टू थ्री डेज आर मोर देन सफिशियंट यूल कवर इट तो इसमें टाइम नहीं लगेगा और अभी इफ यू हैव इन स्टार्टेड एफ एम फर्स्ट कवर ओपन चैनल फ्लो and when uh, the time is remaining then complete uh, fluid mechanics theek hai aisa nahi bol do don't leave it but agar abhi kuch bhi nahi padhna start kiya then first do open channel flow and after that you go for fluid mechanics theek hai so fine that's all for today guys and if you want me to make video on any other topic kindly comment in the comment section and i'll meet you in the next video till then take care of yourself bye bye and study hard thank you everybody